Hello everybody, welcome back to Stoneheart We Bantle. So today we're gonna continue with Silver Rock. We're gonna continue to design our gate here, which we are getting more and more closer to pretty much having this done the most of the part of it. So what we're gonna do today is to start to like shape the top of these towers. And there are like a billion of different ways that you can do this. I wanna try a thing first and see if I like it. It's gonna be I would say slightly different than what I normally do. The thing I want to try is to actually go like this and make this thing hold up uh, the tower. So I did some research and I found some cool towers. It seems to be a pretty common thing for many to have these things to stick out like this. I tend to have to go pretty much like this under it, which I think looks really nice as well. But I want to try something different. So we're going to see how this roof is going to work. I hope it's going to be looking really, really cool. But we're gonna see once we pretty much get there, because I haven't seen it on my own in the game so far, so... I was gonna add some more names today, guys. I got a lot of names from you guys, I'm really happy. And I'm also gonna start to randomize who gets into the game. I'm gonna use a randomizer and uh, I will be going through your names and adding you in. For the moment though, I'm just gonna pick a few names that we got said yes so far and we're gonna add some of them so some of you guys are already gonna come into this town today and some of you guys will have to wait quite a while we, we will see what happens the more halflings we get to join the more of you guys can get in, get in pretty much so i think this is gonna be pretty interesting and another side note that one of you guys said that when you make something like this like let's say we're making two towers like i did i could of course have made one tower fully completed and just paste it over here and that would be half the amount of clicking to do that which is really awesome there's some flaws to it that i see though that if i would do it since i don't know how this in between would look it could create a lot of issues i have to remove and so on so personally i think i still prefer to do it this depending on you know what we're gonna do it depends on what we're doing if we're just gonna make a tower and we can use that multiply places, that is a really good thing to do it in that way then. Okay, so we got these things going out. So now we just gotta figure out how we wanna do this thing. So uh, I wonder if we should go for this color or if we should go for a different one, like maybe this one. So I'm just gonna like add this first over this. And then we're gonna figure out how this is gonna be. We don't really have to have so it goes out as much on these ones. We can have pretty much it goes like that. Maybe that's great and cool, interesting shape. We will see once we get further with this. We're just gonna have to experiment and try things. That's kind of how I like to do it. You know, like find some inspiration and make it into your very own thing. That's kind of how I like to do it. Okay, so there we go, we got both towers like this. So maybe what we want to change is like this one. To go see, like this. I think that will make it look nicer. Doesn't have to make it look nicer, but hopefully it will. Can reverse back a bit just to make sure. Because I did a double click there, you never know what you'd done if you click and you didn't see what you did, so always worth to like revert if that happens but uh, sometimes the revert and doesn't work so you don't have much options when that occurs so so let's see how we can make this thing if we're going to go for a different color for the top we could go for a dark black color pretty much as we have been using over the entire tower it could work and maybe it actually fits in with the rest of it so what i want to try first is where we have these things maybe see if we can put some out here I don't know if we want to go that way, we are going to try it first. Either we will remove a few, or we will go like, fully like this thing. See that we have removed something here. Supposed to have one more there. Either we go pretty much like this, or we will go in this way. But we're going to try this way first here, so we have a little bit of holes here. Probably going to mess something up. So it's actually like this that we're gonna go. This is very easy for me to mess something up here. That's the thing with the game, if you're gonna go custom really much, there's so many like risks that you're gonna mess something up. I think I already did here. So what I'm gonna do is actually just to make it easier for myself, I'm just gonna add in 
the full of it first just to make sure that it pretty much looks the same so here we got five we've got six so something is slightly different maybe we went for touching one of the sides yeah we're touching that side is let's do it like this but this can definitely get very confusing i feel like i can get so confused when looking at all these things is we got some stone enemies here, so I'm gonna send out my soldiers. Should be Genghis Khan that's gonna go out for us if I don't remember it wrong. Yep. So I still think that uh, Genghis is gonna be enough for protecting against them. But you know, we can always use our rest of our population to help a little bit with it. So I'm gonna put him to guard this area for now. Let's use some other people. They're really, they're really useful to have some some extra help. So I think we should be pretty safe when we got going on here. Okay, we're safe, Genghis Khan, and who was this? Cecil Hunterton protected us. So I'm gonna name Cecil, and uh, this is gonna be Prince Steve. Probably gonna be a soldier in the future. And I'm also gonna name a girl. So we're gonna name a few people in like each episode. Yona here, we're gonna name. So this is gonna be uh, Arisa. So welcome Arisa Town Town. Hope you have a great, great time here. So that's what we're gonna name for now. And uh, let's see here. I'm actually gonna fill in full of black all the way. Going all dark like this. This is gonna be easier to overlook this entire thing. These towers, they are fairly huge to be honest and we're gonna control check these things so they are not messed up pretty much we have seven in between each of these okay so it should be the same should be the same and uh, let's try this out let's see what happens if we and something there's not really so much space here to be honest. We could go somewhere like that. Yeah, let's try it out first. Okay, so there we go for that. I think they look pretty interesting towers. They're very very wide. However, I'm thinking about adding something. I don't know if we should add this thing. Maybe this will make it too much of bad, this. I think we should skip that. So maybe something like this will be what we get, and we can also... Let's try to remove a few of these. I think that looks pretty okay. That also means if we remove that one, maybe it looks nice to, if we add that. I think we're gonna go that way. I think that looks pretty nice. And I'm thinking about if we should add another mod to the game, by the way. It depends what you guys think. There's another mod called uh, Brewery. Adds a lot to the game. It's really awesome, so if you guys would like to see Brewery, maybe in this town or in a future town, let me know in the comments and uh, we will probably be checking it out in the future. There's another mod I want to show as well, which is really awesome. It uh, changed the games quite a bit of the mod, so I'm gonna make at least one video with that mod and we're gonna see what you guys think about it. So I wanna do a few more things that I was thinking about before, like add something here. I wanna have like a straight line that goes between these two things. It's always a little bit hard to drag this out for some reason. See, it just drags out like crazy. It's really hard to get this straight for some reason. Sometimes you just have to change the angle a tiny little bit. Like here, we almost got it. There we got it. It's really tricky and sometimes even when you just click one it just messes the entire thing up. I've also been thinking about adding some kind of flag under here. Maybe in this way. Make a big flag. The troublesome thing with this game is like every time when you add, add something under something, it is really troublesome. Look at this. 
I promise you this is gonna get troublesome, but it could be worth it because it could look nice. So I'm just gonna make a flag and we can see if we like it. I just wanna have some extra small, small details. So I think if we go for a flag that pretty much looks like this, we should try to keep most of uh, the flags in town red. I think that's gonna be the best. We see that we have some extra here for some reason. I wish they kinda add something in the future so we can look fully underneath things and around them because that is really needed when you're doing stuff like this. And when we're doing like windmills, it's even more needed because it's already like pretty frustrating to do them. So maybe we can do something like this, uh, something like that, so it's like hanging down. Maybe we should make it wider. However, if we make it like this, I don't think it's gonna make a huge difference. It just, I'm thinking about these tiny holes that we got going on here. I don't think it's gonna make a huge difference. Because it's equal numbers. So you know, it would be like that, and I don't know if that looks better. I think what we had looked better than that. I think this looks better than the other one. And we can even add some like color variation as well if we want to. I'm actually gonna add a dark color to this. Maybe something like that. Pretty simple, maybe pretty nice. Let's add some uh, random like color changes. So just a slightly brighter color. Just to make the flag like stand out a little bit more. I don't know, maybe this is too much, I don't know. You guys will see what you think about it. I just think it's nice to have something more. We haven't built this yet, if you don't think we should have the flag like that, let me know in the comments and we will do something different. It could hang something here as well, I don't know. So the net worth is going up a little bit and now one of you guys also asked that uh, Pretty much if gold goes towards the net worth in the game. And yes it does, there were a bug recently though when it actually didn't go towards the net worth. But it uh, should be fixed at the latest alpha 18 as far as I understood it from the patch notes. So some more crate should be nice. We're also gonna change these farms later. It works like this way but there's one more efficient way. If you've seen my videos before you probably know how you do it. Pretty much you ha can have the same space but with a double amount of like things growing on it so it's really useful the shorter paths to walk to everything and so on also so whoops hopefully i can revert yes i could awesome so we can add this thing we kind of had it like underneath before so i want to have this thing here as well you know keep the theme going for this we can also have flags on this we can have we can even have some tiny flags down here. I would love to have something more reddish added to this. And maybe, I'm not sure. We're gonna have walls here. Maybe we can start with walls. Just to get started. Or maybe we should build these ones. I do feel pretty satisfied with the towers itself. Kinda at least. I think we can build this, you know, we're not gonna have enough resources though, like look at this. We need to make some windows, which need stones, we need 88 stone to make this entire thing, so, you know. It's gonna be a lot of work to actually be able to do this, and we also need to get an... Uh, don't we need a stone mason for this? Did I? Or do I have a stone mason? Oh actually, we did get a stone mason, yes. So we should be able to make them, because... If we can place them in here, we should be able to make them. But maybe we should actually work a little bit on the walls. And uh, we're not done with this. The good that I didn't start to build this, because uh, we're gonna be able to walk from these to the walls. And I'm not sure if they're gonna be able to walk... Should there be a door here and another door here? Mm, I guess we can have that. I'm gonna go for a double door down here. I know this is taking a real long time, by the way, but I think it's gonna be worth when we're making this. I definitely think it's gonna be worth it, because it's gonna be awesome. So, something like that, and then we can add walls. They're able to go from the walls to the tower, both from under it and also 
when you're walking on the walls. And this time I actually can make so people can... You no, know, they can actually walk on... Inside of the walls. So I'm gonna make it something like this, I think. Might go for custom walls. Reason is that if we do that... It will not go like around here, we can like keep things you know, open and such so. We have it like that pretty much, have an uh, entrance, we need a way to get up here also. So maybe we should do the stairs before we do the door there. I think we can keep adding a little bit here. So it's important to check here, like, I noticed that it wasn't the same. So we have to go like this and remove one line here, and that should make it the same for both sides. Let's see how much we added. So 13, okay. So I'm really gonna go full in with this town. I and make it look amazing. That's the goal with it. And I hope we can achieve it. I think we can. We'll see if we're gonna have a tower here or not. Might just be some kind of curvy thing. I don't know if we're gonna have a tower. I think it might be too close to this. Maybe a smaller tower. A smaller than these ones. Because this is the main entrance, the gate to this town. So we need to have something to walk on. I think this color is going to be nice for that. It'd be nice. And we're going to go and uh, use this one. Maybe let's do use a slab here. So make it stick out one. I think we're going to do the same for this. So this is something a little bit different than we've done pretty much lately. Where we have only done for the outside this thing. So we're going to do it for both sides this time. So now I think it's time to like figure out where we want to have stairs to go up and how we want how we want them to look. So I kind of want to have them so um, they go maybe from this side and up. I think that would be nice. We can make this pretty long as well if we want to. I think yeah, maybe three and width is pretty nice for it. Or we can go to like four to make it look even more amazing. So here we will have to remove a little bit this. Here to get up, we have to remove even more here. So we're gonna do the same thing for the other side. So we're gonna get the size, we got 12, okay. That was one too much. I think that should be about it. Yep. And we can either we can we can make something like this. I think that looks really cool when you're making this thing. I think we're gonna do it in this way. Pretty awesome. And we can uh, if we want to we can still keep this like a dark blackish theme going on here. Maybe we will even fill this in. Maybe we go in that way. Maybe it's too much of this dark color. I don't know. I'm gonna go like that. That should be nice. Uh, I guess we can add this thing here like we did with the other one. Have it in that way. Should be cool. However, maybe. I don't know if we should like go here and uh, remove. I think that looks nicer. Doesn't look like as simple and straight and everything is like a little bit more shape to the entire thing. So we got the base for that. That's nice. But guys, this is gonna be it for today. We got working with the walls. The towers, I think they look better than they did before and I really like that we 
went for a different way with these things. I think that's gonna be awesome. And let me know guys if you think we should have a flag here, if we should have this flag, if we should make a new flag, if we should move it to some different place, if we should have flags to some other places. Let me know in the comments and I will be reading it in the next episode. So guys, thanks for checking out this video and feel free to leave your name suggestions in the comments and I will be adding you. I will randomize the names for the future so there's a pretty much a higher chance for you to get in no matter like when you actually request your name and it's gonna be more interesting so. So guys, thanks for checking out this video. I hope to see you next time and take care.